bullion is non-collectible gold and silver. Non-collectible gold or silver is a great way to shore up the defensive side of your wealth portfolio. 7K makes it easy. They carry physical gold and silver in different forms. They only sell the things they have in inventory. You won't find minimums or maximums, period. You can literally start with a dollar if that's your current budget. And one of the coolest things is the 7K has made transacting in gold and silver possible again. It makes it easy for you to create and execute a good defensive strategy. But there isn't a good sports team in history that has won a championship on defense alone. Just like that, you will also need a very good offensive strategy. That offensive strategy can be found inside of collectibles. The collectible market has proven to be a robust way for wealthy families around the world to not only protect, but also grow their wealth, and more importantly, their legacy. A collectible usually has to be rare or low mintage, has to have unique or artistic designs, a great story, or have historic significance. So if you look at the paper this amazing Spider-Man comic book from 1962 is printed on, it's only worth a couple of dollars. In 2021, this comic book sold for a record $3.6 million. The person or family that bought this book was not buying the paper. They were buying the emotion, the art, rarity, story, and other things they found valuable about this book. In fact, most wealthy families that are playing the collectibles game are doing it not only for their financial protection or gain, but also to preserve their family legacy. If you look at the top five places wealthy families turned in order to protect and grow their wealth during the financial crisis of 2008, you will see that three of the five things are collectible in some way. And the other two, sound money. Unfortunately, not many families have an extra million or two laying around to buy high-end collectibles, nor would they even know where to start. But 7K is bridging the gap so that the average family can start playing the game with rare, unique, but also affordable collectibles through modern coins. In 2004, a coin called Tiffany Art No. 1 hit the market for about $90. Now $90 doesn't seem unreasonable for the average family to scrape together in order to add this incredible coin to their wealth portfolio. Today though, if you wanted to go buy this same coin, it would cost you at least $8,000. But the metal in the coin is only worth roughly $50 today. The additional value in the coin is due to the rarity, story, beauty, or whatever else a potential buyer finds to be valuable. That is the added leverage or offense collectibles can add to a wealth portfolio. You can see here just a few more examples of the same thing play out in other coins. Modern collector coins have a very good track record over the last 20 to 30 years of being a powerful tool inside of the offense of a well-rounded wealth strategy. 7K not only offers some of the best coins from around the world, but also designs and mints its own coins, given 7K members exclusive or first access. 7K also makes adding cool, unique, and rare collectible coins extremely easy through one of the most powerful member benefits called the Autosaver. The Autosaver program takes all of the thinking out of collecting and leverages the experts at 7K to send you a rare and exclusive collectible coin every single month. It is truly a set it and forget it, zero discipline approach to automate your collectible asset stacking. You will just need to choose one of the options you like best and watch them show up at your door every month. There are other ways you can also take your stacking to the next level though, with your own shopping cart called 7K Selected and also special sales called Coin Drops. 7K provides many ways to win with collectible gold and silver. As you can see here, Eddie Spears has spent very little time to get a massive head start making sure a wealth legacy comes from him. All the same, Chris Latin Sr. says he collects both bullion and collector coins, and you can see he has built a very nice stack. He even claims it is now one of his most valued possessions because of what it will mean for him and his family in the future. 